Hey guys, I'm up here in good old Payson today and I'm planning a really exciting rock counting trip up here. I'm going to be looking for some fossils, some agate, and who knows what else we may find up here. So join me on this adventure as we get started. This is sure to be a pretty fun rock counting trip today. I'm planning on hitting up a number of areas that I've been wanting to check out. This type of rock counting is usually more of a scouting around for anything good, rather than a return to collect some of the goods. So a lot of ground can really be covered in one trip. It can get pretty fast paced though, bouncing from one spot to the next. Our first destination is around Payson. I'm hoping that some of these recent rains might have brought up some of the goodies to the surface. So up this rocky hill that ATVs seem to use quite often. Whoa, already found a pretty neat rock. Just look at this guy. I'll just leave him behind. Here we go. This is what I came for. Some good old calcite. Look at those sparkles. No, oh, quite a number of little guys over here. They might have broken off this bigger specimen, I think. Whoa, what's this now over here? Look at this big guy. Hmm, to take or to leave. A rock hounder's worst question. Oh, this sure is a neat looking one. Look at the crazy crystallization on this one. This one's a keeper. Just beautiful. Here's another one that must have rolled downhill. It's still got some dirt on it. It has some really nice bands to it too. Now, I've just got to make my way across to that main hill over there. Whew, that brushy hike sure was worth the effort. Just look at this crazy guy. Wow. Wow. This one's totally amazing. Just look at the awesome banding on it, too. What a rock. And this one next to it. What? This crazy guy sure got some wild stripes. Look at that. More of a grayish tint to it, too. Whoa, looks like I'm onto a nice vein of this stuff. Here's another nice beauty that just flashed at me in the sunlight. Wow. Whoa, and this one next to it. What a monster. Now let me zoom in here on this one. Wow. It's time to head to the next stop. This is a new area to me, but I'm hoping to find some cool fossils or something in the area. We're heading into the deep forest now to explore. This paved road won't last long though. Oh neat, look at this rotted out stump. I just love things like this. How special and unique. <sighs> Nothing quite like the fresh air of a pine forest. What great and amazing things await to be discovered around in this area, I wonder. Sadly, this can be quite a nightmare for finding rocks. There's just so many pine needles on the floor. Oh, but look at this beautiful manzanita bush. These guys are some of my favorite vegetation out here. So beautiful. Well, let's get to it. Hmm. Well, that one's not too interesting. Maybe over here. Nope. What about this one? Nah. Autumn sure is pretty out here. These wonderful yellow leaves and these happy little and big trees. They're just having a wonderful good old time living out here.
Well, I think it's going to be near impossible to find any rocks under all these leaves. I probably should have brought a rake with me. <laughs> Well, that area sure turned out to be bust, but at least it was cool just to explore around. Time for the next stop. Now I'm near the rim. This place surely has to have some fossils around it, I bet. Look at this beautiful cliff here. Just fantastic eye candy, I think. Oh, what's in this dirt here? Oh, looks like a trace fossil here. Yep, now this is a neat find. This could be a mud crack that's been fossilized over the years, or even fossilized roots. You can really see the fine detail and web patterns in this one. Whoa. And look, even the surface has this really beautiful sheen to it. Oh, I just love this. There's even some over here with a little bit of a bluish hue to them. Boy, I sure hope I can find some good specimens of these. This color sure is pretty. Nope. Just not really finding anything that I want to take back yet. Oh wow, check this one out. Whoa, now this is a good one. You can see here how all the many layers have been put down over time. I'm not sure why, but looking at stuff like this sure is wonderful. Just beautiful. Oh, I think I see something up here over on this sketchy slope. Eh, I'll leave you behind, my little friend. Oh, but this bluish one over here. Oh, jackpot! Look at this crazy specimen. Now this one's a keeper. Time to hit up the next area. We're heading over to good old Christopher Creek. This area's got a lot of interesting and neat stuff around it. Definitely worth checking out. There's just so much to explore around here. Check out this neat little waterfall. This is surely a place of zen right here. Well, it's back to rock hunting. Look at this colorful guy. Yep. Another keeper right here. Wow. Oh, these cute little agave plants all over the place. Just sprouting up. Yeah, but there's some really thorny bush friends of theirs right next to them. Hiking further in, away from those mean old bushes with the thorns. Perhaps there might be some cool stuff over here. Oh, a banded rock. This is neat. Oh, man, and some garbage. This stuff always saddens me greatly. Oh, look at this. A crinoid stem piece. This is a cool find. No, oh, this is a big chunk of chert. We'll just leave that behind. So many rocks, and so little time. Look at all these sparkles on this guy. Whoa, this one is so cool. Now, oh, even some zebra agate around here. Look at all these wild stripes. Some more shirt. I'll definitely be doing some more polishing videos on these guys for sure. Oh now, what's this over here? Hmm. Oh, 
Oh, look at this. There's little fossils inside these cavities. How crazy is that? This is a cool find. Well, guys, what a super fun and awesome day this has been. Unfortunately, I've got the sun starting to go down and we're losing light pretty quick, so it's time to start heading back, but I think it was pretty productive today. Well, guys, I really hope you enjoyed today's adventure, and thanks so much for viewing. Till next time.